Do my eyes deceive me? The Mekonis is moving. Boy, you! I'm warning you! You better not drop me! You let me go, and you'll be doing sit-ups for the rest of your life! Yes, Colonel! Venea, I am sorry. For Lady Manus' will to be realized, I had no choice but to use your body. Even so... Actually, I'm grateful. Thanks to this body, I got to see Shulk and the others again. <laughs> Where is Lady Manus now? Shall I call her? She is usually asleep. Maybe she just doesn't want to disturb me. It's an unusual feeling. Two hearts in one body. It's not every day you get to experience something like this. I see. That is a great relief. It's as if I can see into our heart. We each know what the other's thinking, but it's strange. It feels like there's a part of my heart that's hidden. It's the part that holds Manus' feelings, and I can't see them. Maybe it's only natural. Everyone has one or two secrets, right? But I know how much she cares about this world. That's why I'm happy to let her use my body. Fiora, I think Lady Maynath is glad that she met you. Yeah, I know. Good news from His Highness. The Allied force retreated in time. Casualties were kept to a minimum. Glad to hear it. That's great news. All areas are being prepared for evacuation. We can only hope they make it. We won't let them down. This is one fight we can't afford to lose. Here upon Ricky, all set. Ricky found some heads. We'll go with you. Can't beat strength in numbers. Really? You're the tough old timer. What's this? The old fossil wants to tag along. As long as you don't slow us down. Uh, let's see who makes it through that battle. We're here. Everyone ready? Ready. 
Anytime. Leave it to Hero Von Ricky. <sighs> hey, Shulk. What is it this time? Stop worrying and come on. The Monado isn't at full strength. I don't know if it can beat Egil. You're talking about that apocryph... whatchamacallit thing. Don't worry. He's no match for all of us together. At least the previous encounter allowed us to gauge how he fights. We won't make the same mistakes again. The core is directly linked to the Apocrypha generator. Destroy the generator, and the Apocrypha field will deactivate, allowing Shulk's Monado to function properly again. Now you tell us. I wish you'd said something earlier. Oh, Shulk, did you hear that? <laughs> Looks like you'll get your wish. Something's not right. What? Egil. He called me Zanza. The same Zanza who... devastated Mechonis. What did he mean? He was just trying to get to you. I told you before, right? I haven't had any visions lately. Yeah? But I still know... If I concentrate, I feel like something will happen, and it does. Are you saying you don't need a vision to know what comes next? Pull the other one. Ryan, you're going to scratch your head with your right hand. <gasps> what are you on about, Shulk? Stop playing around. Oh. But... How did you do that? I can't work it out. Ever since we came to Mechonis, my abilities have been changing. Why would that happen? <sighs> If it's true that Zanza used the Monado to lay waste to Mechonis, then... Is it right for me to use it? Is what I'm trying to do really the right thing? Shulk! control of the Monado has always been flawless. It never crossed my mind that this would happen to you too. Are you sure you're okay? Perhaps you are suffering this much because you put all your energy into fighting the effect of the Apocrypha. Haven't you learnt yet, Shulk? How many times do I have to tell you? If something's up, you've got to spit it out, man. I ain't just talking about visions. I mean, whatever's on your mind. All right? Mm. S sorry, Ryan. Don't go apologizing. It's my fault for not noticing. Let's get one thing straight. I've still got your back. Uh, thanks. No. Huh? Prepare to die. Shulk. No. Zanza. This wasn't caused by the Apocrypha. It's a completely different kind of power. Shulk. What's happening to me? I know I should be glad we made it this far, but if we don't find the Apocrypha generator soon... Exactly. The fight against Egil's not going to be easy with the Monado in its current state. And we don't know what kind of toll it'll take on Shulk's body. We have to destroy that generator. It's up ahead. Shulk? There's a strong energy coming from up ahead. That has to be it. Really? Yes. Then this is it. Egil's gonna be scrap metal when I'm through with him.
It's just as I thought. The Monado feels the same as it did before the Apocrypha took effect. No. It feels even more powerful. The Bionis Monado. And this Monado. They have to be connected. Somehow. Because... You aren't here. Not anymore. Why am I remembering that dream? Why now? <sighs> Without the power, I can't stop Egil. I have to concentrate. All I have to think about is how to stop the Mechonis. If the Monado does bring about the end, then I know what to do. Fiora! Shulk, what were you thinking about? Uh... Uh, nothing. So... It's like that, is it? Really, it's nothing. Listen, Shulk. If it's too hard for you to handle on your own, talk to me. Huh? Fiora... You can tell any of the others as well. We're all here for you. Don't forget that. You're right. You're here for me. Of course. And don't overdo it, okay? We all saw what happened. Is your arm okay? Yeah. It's not bad. I'll live. Oi! You two! Is something up? No! It's nothing. Come on! Mm-hmm. You can... Machine. Is this? Yes. The Apocrypha Generator. Yeah. Let's trash the thing. We take this out and it's plain sailing for Shulk. It should be. It is a miracle that you have been able to use the Monado at all. Hear that? Uh. Are you really all right? I yeah. I'm... fine. Venea, we need to find Egil. The control core is directly above. It is not far. Wait! It's moving! No! We're too late! You mean? The Mechonis functions have been restored! No! It can't be! Yes! You puny pests are too late! has struck. Not good. I think it must have hit somewhere on Bionis. No. No. Move out! Don't forget, we've still got a job to do. Right! Uh, what? It's my fault. 
You on that, Apoka, whatever. We did it, Shulk. Shulk? Oi! <sighs> Whoa. What's happened to the Monado? It must have changed just as the generator was destroyed. It's amazing. Now we're talking. Next up, Egg Hill. Can you go on? Me? I'm all right. Come on, we have to stop Egg Hill. Back on track. Just like I said. The kid will come through. Naturally. Everything is falling into place. <laughs> you can say that again. But only as long as we remain within the margins of fate, I know not how things will proceed from this point. So, you worms have finally arrived. Egil! Stop the Makonis! 
There has to be a way for us to live in peace. There's no reason for us to fight. You must stop this now! My reasons are clear and truer than yours. What's that? Look, it's Bionis. May the roar of the Makonis be the wrath of my people. How many? Huh? How many do you think died in that attack? Hundreds? Maybe thousands? Echil, you'll regret this! Brother, stop this! You'll destroy the Bionis! Let us put an end to our torment! It ends when I say it ends! I will end our curse by destroying the world! You must realize that is not Lady Maynard's wish! That's why she left us her legacy, our whole world! Pure nonsense. That thing lurking within the Homs girl is no longer our god. This world no longer has a need for gods. Echil! Stop it! Face me, Shulk, successor of Zanza. I'll crush the Bionis and spread its ashes across the world. Then I'll turn the Monado into dust. Only then will there be peace. My
What you want? Yes, I want to. I'll kill him for Fiora, for the Emperor, for my home. You must find your Monado. Are you ready? Are you feeling hungry, eh? 
Chew on this, scratch you for even brain. You kill a hum, Mr. Beatus. I want you to kill. I once wished only I to break I the circle of suffering. Until I've he scrapped each and every one man. of you! Maynard, the villagers, yes. everyone loved you. Every person. Yes. That is why they Finish wished him. to live alongside End you. End it. The way it is what so you clear. want. To Maynard and to me. <sighs> no! This isn't what I want! Shulk! No! Brother! Why didn't you do it? Killing me would have saved your world. I've forgotten all about that. Forgotten about it? I realized that we both share the same pain. Egil, I don't have any reason to kill you. Even if you do not, I still do. I know. But I won't do it. If you do not kill me now, my blade will annihilate every last one of your people. Even then. I can't kill you, but I can stop your blade. And I'll do it. Over and over again until... We understand each other. Okay? <sighs> you have used the Monado well. But do you honestly believe you are its master? Maconis and Bionis once lived in harmony. They coexisted in peace, without hatred or strife. Egil, hey, why do you think we were born? Ah, philosophy. Alas, I am not very good at answering such questions. Have you never thought about it? Never contemplated what lies beyond this world? Beyond this world? <laughs> Lady Mayneth once said that aside from the Bionis and the Meconis, this world is filled with nothing but boundless ocean. But what lies beyond that? We are still young and unable to leave the Bionis or the Meconis. Say goodbye to our creators, our world. But one day our descendants will. They will leave this place and depart for new worlds. Worlds we have never imagined by strength of their will alone. Leave this place? That is something I have never considered. However, it would be a truly amazing sight. Egil, I, I wish to see that the people of Bionis and the people of Mechonis live in peace and harmony and take care of one another. I wish this for the future of our descendants. Yes, I too desire this, Aglas. Everybody shared the belief that the prosperity of our two worlds would continue for all eternity. It would have done were it not for the Monado. The Monado refused to permit the existence of the Meconis, or rather, the existence of anything but itself. And one day, it took control of my friend, Arglas and he became Zanza. It was Arglas, possessed by Zanza, who directed his sword at Maconis. I don't understand. Does being controlled by the Monado mean you will eventually become Zanza? The Monado is Zanza. Zanza is the Monado. The two are one and the same. In order to perpetuate the existence of his soul, Zanza inhabits beings of Bionis. 
but you appear to be different. What do you mean? I can see it. How well you retained a sense of self. Perhaps you can break the curse of Zanza. And was that not precisely our wish, Lady Mayneth? I don't know much about any curse. For now, all I can do is this, Egil. We can live in peace again. Again? I see. Yes, you're right. Shouldn't have done that, little brat. Shulk! Uh, uh. Dixon! Why? Why, old man? Are you completely out of your mind? Ah, don't you kids ever shut up. I'm just doing my job, as always. Right? Who are you? It... It's you. Yes. Now you remember. It's been a long time, hasn't it, Eggle? Too long. Huh? Zanza's disciple. Zanza's disciple? Eagle, what do you mean? Dixon, what are you? I don't have to explain anything. As they say, seeing is believing. Now, witness it with your own eyes. The moment of Lord Zanza's return. Shulk! Get away from him! No! Ah! Sansa! I won't let you do this! Do not be surprised. Everything in this world is dictated by the passage of fate. As all that exists is interconnected, time can flow only towards the inevitable. That is the vision of which I, the Monado, am the origin. That which will be, will be. This was all predestined. Ever since I came to reside within Shulk. What do you mean? Zanza grew tired from our battle. And then the High Entia ancestors trapped him. His flesh was sealed away on Prison Island. His soul, and hence the Monado, was confined to Ose Tower. In those ruins? But what does this have to do with Shulk? Did you forget? Who discovered those ruins? Who happened to be there? Who was the survivor we found? And who brought back that survivor? What are you saying? You planned all this when you found Shulk! Jackpot! It was all for this day. In fact, there was never anyone called Shulk to begin with. What? My soul existed inside the Monado. It was fated that I be released. 
It was shown to me in a vision. At last the time finally came, and then... The people who found the Monado and freed it awoke Sansa. He sucked the lies from them so he could live. Shulk was among them. Shulk was already dead. That's impossible. We grew up together. You grew up with an empty shell. He appeared to live because I became his life force. That is until he had matured as my new vessel and become worthy of wielding the Monado allowing me to truly awaken and finally return. Lord Zanza is the soul of the Bionis, but he still needs a living body. Just like Mayneth over there. <laughs> Call that corpse a friend? Don't make me laugh. But why use Shulk? What was it that made you select Shulk as your vessel? There was no particular reason. Shulk merely happened to be there at the time. There you have it. Anybody would have done. As long as they could swing a sword around, at least. So then, Shulk's ability to use the Monado... And those visions that he used to save us. All because of Lord Zanza. Lord Zanza can see the passage of fate. He simply led you to the inevitable. The destruction of Colony 9. The death of that pompous old high entier fool and that grunt Gado's miserable demise. All of it. You evil. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> There's more. We haven't even got to the best part. What are you gonna do, Dixon? Don't you get it? You're just in the way. The lot of you. This world was created by Lord Zanza, by the very Bionis itself. Then you things think you can just spring up all over the place. All life that is born from me must be returned to me eventually to complete the cycle. For me to continue my existence as before, then all must be restored to its former order. In other words, the destruction and recreation of the world. Nothing more to it. First, we must eliminate my greatest obstacle. You, Maynith, the Maconis! The Bionis! Bionis moves! I've been waiting. Waiting for this day. Sansa! Brother, stop! You're too weak! I don't care. I will gladly sacrifice myself to eliminate Sansa. As long as he lives, there can be no peace for us or for the people of Bionis. Ha! Then you shall cease to exist by the wrath of my blade! It's... the Monado! I'll show you the meaning of wrath! Is a side meaningless sentiment. Zanza! Right now, yeah. How could you do this? It is from me that all life is born. It lives only for me, and it shall be returned.
<laughs> so you have finally unleashed your Monado. And there was me thinking you would die with dignity. I finally understand. The futures of our children belong to them alone. Though we are their creators, their lives are theirs to control. Even if the passage of fate is as you have decided. I will teach you the strength of their will to resist. Zanzer, if you choose to deny the existence of every living being but yourself, then I choose to fight. To fight for them! That's right. We won't let you erase everyone's futures! This battle is mine, Maynard! <laughs> Is that all you've got? Ah! Is that all you've got? Feel the weight of your existence. You're out of here. Take this. Drain. Go. Hill barrier. Ha! Lock on. Is that all you've got? Uh, take this! You are a pathetic excuse for a god! Uh, take this! Is that all you've got? What? <laughs> Is that all you've got? Double uh, blade! <laughs> Is that all you've got? <laughs> Something wrong. Is this the height of your skill? You call yourself a god. And you talk of sharing this world with me. So that's why the dead boy is important to you. The homes are nothing but bacteria clinging to my body. They are living beings. If you cannot understand this, you have no right to call yourself a god. And who decides that? A god. Because only a god may decide. This world only needs one god made May you rot in that shell for all eternity. Fiora! Face me like a god! If not, then say goodbye to your putrid friends! Zanzaaa! Such a fool. This is... What I wish, this world belongs to you all. Create a world with no need for gods. Is the passage of fate.
Zenza disappear? He's gone. And things ain't looking good for us. <laughs> Let, Let it begin. begin. The ceremony of destruction and recreation! your feelings. Leave it to us. We know what we must do. We will do all we can for the people of Maconis. Uh, now go. Shulk can still be saved. Do not let the last glimmer of hope be extinguished. Megil, go in peace. Let's go. We're leaving the Maconis. Ryan, take care of Shaw. Got it. Ah, uh, you okay? Yes. Good. It still works. The whole place is gonna blow. We must return to Junks via the central factory. Let's go. Thundern, what about Egil? He'll fight Zanza to the very end. But we have our part of the bargain. Once he's gone, we're the only ones left. Let's move, everyone! Goodbye, my brother. <laughs> 